Masterworks of Islamic Architecture. Absolutely gorgeous volume. This one, there is the Alhambra Palace. From Damascus to Granada, Cairo to Istanbul. Here are the riches of Islamic architecture. Cordoba Mosque, called the Mesquita, which was built around older churches. That's the Great Mosque in Damascus. Here's some of the extraordinary tile work. Ottoman art, the meaning of Suleiman, the Alhambra of Granada, the colossal Sultan Hassan Madrasa in Cairo. This is typical of the Turkish type of tile. This one from the Blue Mosque. It's Ismic tile. And the domes. And the calligraphy from the Quran. Beautiful portraiture and miniatures. That was produced during the reign of Suleiman. Other imperial works. Handicrafts, weapons and scientific in instruments are all covered too. Moorish palaces fit for Christian kings. This was the Alhambra in Granada. Where I went on honeymoon and so did Grace Kelly so if it's good enough for Grace it's definitely good enough for Annie Aleppo Mamluks so it's the Abbasids the Seljuks the Fat Fatimids the Ayyubids the Almohads the Merinids the Nazrids the Ottomans all left their indelible mark on this great architecture which so many of us enjoy from Africa, Egypt to Morocco, North Africa and Spain and the Levant. Here are the Seljuks in Anatolia which is where I've just got back from. One of the great mosques there and their caravanserai which I also visited. In, in the Cappadocia region and this is where I studied in Cordoba in Spain where I studied at university philosophy and literature. This is a Muslim crypt so here we have classical architecture and masterpieces left behind. Um, the author is um, Henri Stalin who was himself born in Alexandria and is uh, a scholar of Islamic art. Published at $59.95 through bibliophilebooks.com, £20, a bargain. Big, heavy, 360 photographs and 295 pages.